shut that thing off and grab some seat. Thanks for the help. But who are you people? My name is Seer Junda. And this is my captain, Grease Dritus. How you doing? Yeah, the Manus is my ship, but you better pay attention to this lady here. So, who are you? Cal. Kestis. Who was that back there? An Imperial Inquisitor. She's a Force user hunting Jedi survivors. And now that she knows who you are, she will not stop until she destroys you. How do you know so much? And why'd you help me? We track Imperial communications. We heard the Inquisitors were heading to Braca. So we made our move. Oh, yeah? And what's the bounty on Jedi these days, anyway? That's gratitude for you. Look, I get it. You've been surviving on your own for so long that it's impossible to trust anyone. And it's what's kept you alive. But this is about something bigger than just surviving. Like what? Like rebuilding the Jedi Order. You two? Anybody else? Oh, we're not good enough for you? The Jedi Council? Captain, set a course for Bagano. Aye, aye. In the meantime, try and relax. Go, you're safe. For now. Move on and live your life. Find your destiny. Calico! You were talking in your sleep. What? Weirdo. an object and witness events connected to it. You feel its history. It's an echo in the force from the object. Not many Jedi have that skill. How would you know that? I was once a Jedi, but not anymore. Do I know you? No, but I knew your master, Jarrod DePaul. He was a true guardian of the Republic. He was a hero. Listen. Something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but my connection to the Force is damaged. When I meditate, if I let my guard down, I lose control. And it's like I'm back in that moment when... You survived, Cal. And you're not alone. Not anymore. We're coming up on our destination. This is Bagana. A Jedi I knew discovered it before the Purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire doesn't know this place exists? No. So, what's the plan? We hide out here? 
We're done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know you don't trust me. And I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy. And a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. May the Force be with you. Hey, BD-1. I'm Cal. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just I'm looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi, I think. Hold on. Y you know the Jedi? What do you know? Wait, that's the Vault Seer mentioned. Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. You okay? Wait, I can help you with that. Will you let me? Okay. Well, your scum plank is busted, but this should help you get moving for now. Okay, let's try that. The vault. Yeah, that's where I was headed, too. Okay, well... Yeah, I'm all right. Healing stem. You're full of surprises. That's better. Thanks, little droid. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, uh. Okay. <laughs> Here, hop on board. Difficult, Master. Yes, the path is difficult. It may seem impossible, but with persistence and the Force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. You will master any path. Now, do what you must to reach me. Good. Again. Now, reach my position. BD? Well done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Eno Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. 
Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zepho once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zepho homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. You know, I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. There's no way to live. Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. Maybe we're done hiding. Hey, you want to meet some uh, friends of mine? My friend, it appears the Zepho had some interest in death here. Strange. For such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. You passed the test. So you knew about BD1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? Get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! Don't! Get out of there! Get out! That is BD1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of Batoli Reed fabric? Not really. Oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Breeze. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of four sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the Force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zepho homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? 
I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? We're in. Death Mirror Zepho. It's your choice. Look of a storm brewing down there. This might not be the best time to land. Yeah, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Copy that. Oh. Couple bumps ain't gonna kill you, kid. <laughs> Unless the wind picks up. Can you tell that bucket of balls to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. Because it's under control, it's just a little tricky. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on! Oh. Huh. Perfect landing. Greasy money, baby. Uh, but I'm still getting a lot of interference on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to get them back up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. Focus. The Jedi do not seek aggression, but we stand against it. The Force is there to shield us. The obstacles in your path define the path. What stands in the way becomes the way. Now, try again. Faster now. Complete the test. My friend, take a look at the detail on this bark. The distinctive striations. It can only be a rosier tree from Kashyyyk. It's time to call on an old friend. If the Zepho had contact with Kashyyyk, there is a good chance Chieftain Tarful will know about it. <laughs> Just tell me that this visit wasn't for nothing. I found the tomb of a Zepho sage. They definitely used the Force. An advanced civilization of Force wielders who mysteriously vanished. No wonder Master Cordova became so obsessed with them. What else did you find? Before they disappeared, the Zepho journeyed to the planet Kashyyyk. Oh. Cordova had a Wookiee friend named Tarful. Maybe we can find him. Kashyyyk? I, look, things are really bad down there. The, the Empire's muscling in on those Wookiees big time. Then we better get ready for a fight. Oh. I think this lifestyle suits you. So, how are you holding up? I mean, with the Force? Yes, with the Force. I know you said it could be overwhelming. I haven't gotten myself killed yet. I'd rather not talk about it. Yeah, well, I understand. More than you realize. Well, why'd you choose to stop using the Force? When the purge started and our clone troops turned against us, my Padawan and I took several younglings and we went into hiding. But we didn't last long. Imperial Patrol was about to discover our location, so I tried to lure them away from my Padawan Trilla. She stayed behind with the younglings. But they caught me. And they tortured me. They wanted to know about the others and how many were left, but mostly they wanted to know about Cordova 
and where he went. But you escaped. No. It was a prison riot. I saw my opportunity and I took it. But they almost broke me. And I am not the same as I was, Cal. Your Padawan. Did she survive? No. But that's why we can't give up. We can't let the sacrifice of those closest to us be for nothing. We're not running that blockade. Oh, only as a last resort. I've rigged the Mantis' transponder to transmit Imperial signals. Hey, Grease. Yeah? Keep your power signature low and act like we belong. Just like Bracca. No, that's right. I don't need another set of hands. Just please keep your eye on the scanner. All please. Right. All right. All right. I don't see anything. Preoccupied with something on the ground. We're clear. That doesn't look good. The Empire is devouring Kashyyyk for its natural resources. Monkeys have been enslaved or displaced. Oh, that was a close one, kid. Aren't you supposed to be watching the monitors? Guerrilla fighters, Monkeys and off-worlders and bushing an Imperial convoy. Walker's approaching their position. Tarful could be with him. Tarful could be anywhere, like deep in the ground, like we're going to be if we get caught up in that battle down there. We don't have any other options, and, and they'll die without our help. So what's your plan? Sabotage. We use the scrap walkers on Bracca. I'll just jack one. <laughs> get a load of the kid. He thinks we're back in a Clone Wars. Captain, uh, get us near those walkers. Wait, what? Listen, those walkers double as troop transport, so once you get inside, be careful. For no freeze grease to work as magic. Hey, do me a favor. Stay alive down there. I'll add it to the plan. Right, if you're jumping, you better do it now, kid. You ready for a swim, BD? <laughs> There's no pulse. Your 
turn to report fatalities. It's the Jedi! He's on the run! Reading a new ship on scanners. They brought more firepower than we thought. How's our hull looking? Badly damaged. We're at 70% in time. Huh? <laughs> actually worked. Okay, uh, throttle. Report, what's happening over there? You're in violation of Imperial Protocol Shut that guy up. 207. Stand down or we won't have... Yeah. <laughs> Let's do this. Blasters. Let's move forward. Hey! Who are you? Someone who just brought Nat out to the table. Who are you? Someone making the Empire angry. We're advancing on an imp landing pad up ahead. With my fire support. Copy that. Let's make him even angrier. Four troopers ahead. Yeah, I'm okay. You all right? No, you're not doing that again. You just wrecked a perfectly good walker. Got a name? Cal Kestis. So Guerrero. What are you doing on Kashyyyk? Looking for somebody. What are you doing here? My companions and I came to Kashyyyk to disrupt Imperial supply lines. Hey! Who are you looking for? A Wookiee chieftain named Tarful. Tarful is impossible to find. There's a reason he's evaded the Empire for this long. He's a freedom fighter? He's THE freedom fighter. A symbol of the Wookiee resistance. Striking at the Empire from the Shadowlands. Huh. Seer? Grease? This is Saul. How you doing? What do you want with Tarful? Jedi business. Jedi are dead. Not all of them. <clears throat> Get that over corpse? The master gave it to me. This pad supports an imperial refinery that runs on Wookiee slave labor. Intel suggests that some of the captives there are guerrilla fighters. I should help them. One of them might know how to contact Tarful. It's possible. Oh, wait a minute, hold on, wait a minute. The Manus works wonders. I mean, it's a great ship, excellent pilot, but it is not built for close support. We'll stay here and monitor imperial transmissions. With a bit of luck, we'll intercept any distress calls. Appreciate it. My lieutenants and I will scout ahead to prepare the attack. 
Join us when you're ready. Go, go. Imperial Sap Refinery lies dead ahead. What does the Empire want with tree sap? Nothing good. They refine the sap into a powerful compound, and they're rushing to expand production. We have to stop them. That's the plan. We don't know they're in game, but they spread themselves too thin. This map we recovered proves it. Here you go, bud. These refineries double as brutal prison camps. We use those cutters to create a distraction while you take your lightsaber and free the Wookiees inside. We need their help to stop the Empire. Understood. Watch yourself in there. You hear that? Said he needs my help. Come on, buddy. How much current can you conduct? Well, with this transformer, I bet you can short-circuit Imperial Tech. Tight fit, huh, BD? Flame beetles, they're coming through the wall! Hey, we're here to free you. Not alone. Glad to help. Who's ready to fight some imps? All right, let's help these Wookiees get back in the fight. Great work, Jedi. have been hard years. We've lost comrades, friends, family to the Empire. Dark times. And yet the fire still burns. Hope still burns. The Jedi are not yet lost. We are not yet lost. Kashyyyk is not yet lost. For the course! You've seen what the Empire has done to Kashyyyk. These stories are playing out all over the galaxy. My partisans could use a Jedi on our side. I'm honored. But we have our own mission I can't walk away from. Not yet. The offer stands. Keep it in mind. <laughs>